Do you know Power Automate can help you to refresh all your reports in your workspace by just clicking a button or automate refreshing all of them in a specific time? Hello everyone, Shab is here with another video and today I want to talk about an interesting feature that you can use in your reports using Power Automate. Today I will teach you how you can add a button to your report to refresh all the reports just by one simple click or set a schedule to do this action. Please don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel to get the notification for the new upcoming videos. Follow me on LinkedIn, Twitter, and Instagram, and read Power BI articles on my blog. Stay tuned. I previously created a video and showed you how you can refresh your reports using a button. After that, some of you asked me how we can use this button to refresh multiple reports or set a schedule to automate this process. Today, I'm here to describe it, how you can do it in Power BI. Let's jump to my screen. Consider we have a report like this one, and I will create a button and show you how you can use it to refresh this report and other reports in your workspace. But please watch up to the end of this video because I will tell you how you can automate this process and even do it without this button. In the beginning, I just add a table to show the last refresh date and time. So I go to Edit Query, open a new blank query, and in the expression field, I write equal to date time dot local now and open and close parentheses. Now you can see the current local date and time. And if I press on to table button, you can see it will be changed to a table format. Then I just change the column name to refresh date time. And change the table name to last to refresh. Okay, now it's the time to close and apply and go back to the report. Now I'm going to add a text field. And there I just write last refresh. And then I press on value. And in the field, search for refresh date time, which is the name of the column we created earlier to show the last refresh date time for our dataset. Let's press save. And just change the font to Seco UI and size to 14. That's it. So, whenever we refresh our report, this refresh date time will be changed. I just published this report in one of my workspaces. Because here I have only one report, I duplicate the same report and just add a number at the end of each file name and publish them to the workspace. I am doing this just to pretending that we have several reports and apply refreshing on all them together. If I open the workspace, you can see all these three reports here. And it's obvious that you can easily press on this refresh icon beside each of the datasets to refresh them on demand. For example, I refresh this one and you can see the refresh is started. And after some seconds, it will be completed. And here from the settings, you can see the refresh completed successfully. Now, let's open another Power BI file. And there, I want to create a button to refresh all these reports. You can create this button on any of the reports you like. To do that, first, I use Power Automate Visual and on top right of the visual, click on the edit to set the new flow. On the new window, press on new and then instant cloud flow. Press on new step and then search for refresh a dataset.
Here you can choose the workspace and the dataset you want to refresh. In this way, the selected dataset will be refreshed. But here we want to refresh all three datasets and so add new steps and do the same for the other two datasets. After setting all three refresh datasets, press on save and then save and apply and then go back to the report. You can see the Power Automate shape change to button and whenever I click on the button, all three datasets will be refreshed. So let me press on the button and you can see after some seconds it shows trigger. Now we can go to the workspace and you can see here the reports get refreshed, the same as current time altogether. It may take some seconds or even a little bit more based on the size of your dataset. If in future you add another report to your workspace and you want to add it to the same flow, you can easily go to your Power Automate flow and add a new step, the same as previous ones. So you can use this Power BI report to control refreshing all your Power BI report. But now I want to show you how you can automate it and even without having this report and automatically your reports get refreshed. But to set a schedule, we should open Power Automate portal and there from the left menu, click on create button. And this time, instead of choosing an instant cloud flow, choose scheduled cloud flow. You can easily choose a name for it, for example, refresh all datasets. And easily you can set a schedule here. For example, every day at 8 a.m. and choose to repeat every day. Now if you hit create and wait for some seconds, a very similar format to what we created on Power BI will be available here. Press on new step and refresh a dataset. And then choose the workspace and dataset. We do the same process for all three reports and save all the process. And that's it. Every day at 8 a.m. all your reports will be refreshed easily. This is the way how you can easily create a button or set a schedule to refresh one or more datasets. Also, you saw that how easy it is to automate this process. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share it and subscribe to the channel to get the notification for the new upcoming videos. You can also follow me on LinkedIn, Twitter and Instagram and read Power BI articles on my blog. Have a good day, all Power BI lovers.